Hello, this is Irene. I was Kristen's nurse and this is a video about what I would educate her on how to do a self breast exam. So I would educate Kristen on doing it at least seven days after the start of her menses and once a month. Um, she would have to do it in front of a mirror and she would be changing positions to do a good um, inspection which is better than looking down so um, I would have her lean with her arms on her hips leaning forward while she's standing up she would be looking in the mirror looking at her breast both symmetrically for appearance any changes any pole that is different um, symmetry contour any color changes any um, open sores or obvious redness um, she would also be looking at the um, veins is there more prominent veins on one versus the other and um, compare. So the other position that she would have to do is stand upright with her hands on her hips and then do the same process with her hands up behind her um, head and then turning side to side to see her axilla. Um, so the other part that she would need to inspect in front of the mirror would be her areola um, she would be looking for the skin, any color changes, any changes, is it going inward, anything different. Uh, next, we would be, she would be looking at the nipple, is there any discharge, has she noticed any changes in appearance or in the skin around it. Um, and then lastly would be the axilla, so she would be looking on both sides, is there any change in color, any rash. Um, any obvious lesions or is there one side have more hair than the other one that might be indicative um, and then lastly she would be doing some palpation so she would be doing it to both breasts she doesn't have to do it in front of the mirror but she could um, so she's feeling for any tenderness any heat um, any masses any lesions um, so I would be educating her about the tail of Spence which goes up on her shoulder as part of the breast tissue and it goes on both so she would be palpating all the way up to her shoulder make sure there is no changes um, and then she would be doing either circular motion she would have to change go inside to side um, just to make sure she's covering all the tissue and then she would also have to palpate her nipple to make sure there's no obvious discharge um, which are also very important to know